Okay, so today we're gonna be doing a video on this, which is a new, to me at least, new operating system. This is what you call a Remix OS, and I've just installed it on my new laptop here. Let's turn the lamps on for a while, so you can actually see. It's not the white one I used for that magic mode video, because that thing is like, gonna take ages to load, so... Let's go and put it on an angle for while my laptop and let's select some languages so focus in there for a while. There you go. English only has three languages. Let's click agree. Then for this, let's go in my home Wi-Fi. It's not sure the password I'm gonna type it. And connect. So now it's supposed to connect and there you go, connect. Then connected, okay. So next, activate Google Play. Yes, take this. Next. Setup complete. So now you get this Remix OS kind of screen. And there you go, you write in Remix OS. And essentially, this is gonna let you use some kind of like Android apps on this kind of desktop. Uh, I always call it like kind of desktop format. I'm gonna be booting on from this thing, the Android thing. I mean, I used to have like an Android ISO on this USB. But now I'm using this for the Remix OS. So it's actually this 4 gigabytes. They recommend at least 8 or 16. So I might be <laughs> quite reckless, but it's okay. So now let's go and walk through this thing. Now you see this cheater thingy on this corner right there. We'll click that, and then it's gonna like pop out the applications manager thing, like that dotty thing on Android. So it's actually here you can like access all your apps. Start so Google Play Store. And let's go for this thing back up. It says checking in full and you got that next button right there. So I've gotta like wait for a little while till that thing actually finishes. So this is the sign in part. I'm gonna go pause this thing and I'm gonna I'm gonna go like resume this video after I finish signing in. Okay, okay I've inputted the password and now let's Text next, and this is gonna be like accept or, or disagree. If you disagree, just don't do it. I'm gonna accept my battery looks like running low, but <clears throat> put up with it. So let's now do this backup device data, blah blah blah. Yeah, let's take that next, and you got Google Play. Right there. Now let's get started. And let's see if you can actually download DJI Go on this thing. See? Now it's like a fu fully fledged Android system right here. See if you can actually download DJI Go. So let's try the. Sorry. I just stumbled on the tripod a little bit. So let's go. Let's go put this on the laptop again. Let's go right DJI Go. Enter. Oh, <laughs> you can actually download the Jaiko on this thing. Awesome, awesome. So now, it's actually you got this new huge 14 inch monitor for Jaiko. Now, hopefully, it's actually gonna work. And so uh, now I'm gonna go install it and hope for the best. If this actually does work, I'm gonna be using this like as a ground station for my house. So let's click install. Will it install? Except I'm now controlling it from the <clears throat> screen on my phone to actually record properly. So forgive me of whatever I'm doing wrong, like shaking it or something. So excited now. 
my battery so you so let me get an adapter I'm gonna go pause this and when this download actually finishes I'm gonna go come back here